हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल बी स्टडिंग अबाउट एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू मीन्स वी इग्नोर द साइन ऑफ अ नंबर मीन्स एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू ऑफ माइनस ए विल बी ए एंड एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू ऑफ ए इज ऑल्सो ए ओके दिस साइन इज नोन एज द मॉड साइन और द मॉड्यूल साइन सो यू से मॉड ऑफ माइनस ए इज ए मॉड ए इज ऑल्सो ए मीन्स बेसिकली वी डोंट फोकस ऑन द साइन वी ओनली फोकस ऑन द वैल्यू ओके वी ओनली फोकस ऑन द एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू फॉर एग्जाम्पल मॉड ऑफ माइनस सेवन इज सेवन ओके सो वेन द मॉड साइन गोज अवे द माइनस साइन इफ इट इज देयर इट विल गो अवे इफ इट इज नॉट देयर स्टिल द वैल्यू रिमेन्स द सेम फॉर एग्जाम्पल मॉड फाइव इज फाइव ओके वील मूव टूवर्ड्स द एक्सरसाइज मॉड ऑफ फिफ्टीन माइनस टू सो फिफ्टीन माइनस टू इज थर्टीन एंड मॉड ऑफ थर्टीन विल बी थर्टीन इट्स Here mod of फोर minus नाइन so फोर minus नाइन is minus फाइव so mod of minus फाइव is फाइव okay here mod of सेवन into mod of minus फोर now if you see in this case the mod was for the whole thing but here there are two different modulus signs so you solve this di different uh, okay differently so minus सेवन mod of minus सेवन is सेवन mod of minus फोर is Four, so seven into four is twenty-eight. Okay, simple as that. Now, if suppose we say mod of a is five, so what can be the values of a? A can be either five or minus five, isn't it? So a is either five or a is minus five because mod of five is also five, and mod of minus five is also five. Means what did we learn? That if the mod signs sign goes away. Okay, here we get plus or minus, either plus or either minus. Okay, so in the same way, we have mod of three x minus five is one. Okay, so what will happen when the mod sign will go away? What will we have? Three x minus five is plus or minus one. Three x minus five is plus or minus one. Correct. Means three x minus five is one. Or 3x minus 5 is minus 1. Correct. Here it is either 1 or minus 1. Therefore, we have got 1 here, right? So 3x minus 5 is 1, or 3x minus 5 is minus 1. Now you have to just solve this as we did in the eighth standard. We bring the minus 5 here, it became plus 5. 3x as it is, 1 plus 5, 6. You bring the minus 5 here, it became plus 5. Minus 1 plus 5, 4. Okay. Now you bring the three in the denominator. This three will also come down. This three will also come down. Correct. So it becomes six upon three, or x is four upon three. Six upon three is two, and x upon three, uh, four upon three remains as it is. Okay. We'll move to the next question. The second one you have to do on your own. We are doing the third and the fourth. Okay. Now this. 8 minus x upon 2 is mod of 8 minus x upon 2 is 5. Okay. Now when the mod sign goes away, here it will be either 5 or minus 5. Correct. So 8 minus x upon 2 is 5 or it is minus 5. Therefore, now the 2 will go there first. So you get 8 minus x is 10 or 8 minus x is minus 10. Now again, here if you see carefully. The x has a minus sign. Okay, so no use taking the eight there. It will become more complicated. So better you take the x that side and bring the ten this side. Okay, easier way to do. So you get eight minus ten is equal to x. X went that side. It became plus. Ten came this side. It became minus. Similarly here, the x went the other side. It became x. This minus ten came here and became plus ten. Therefore, x is equal to minus two. Or x is equal to 18. Okay. Now the last one. See carefully. 5 plus x upon 4 is equal to 5. Okay. Now when the mod sign will go, it will become either plus 5 or minus 5. Correct. This whole thing will be plus 5 or minus 5. Now the 5 will go there. It will become minus 5. This five also goes there. It became minus five. Five minus five zero. Minus five minus five minus ten. Now the four will go there. 
so x is equal to 0 into 4 or x is equal to this 4 will go there it will become minus 40 so 0 into 4 is 0 obviously and x is 0 or x is minus 40 thank you